सो हम अफगानिस्तान से आए हैं इधर फॉर ट्रीटमेंट के लिए इनका नी में प्रॉब्लम था दर्द था पेन था एंड आल्सो कमर में दस साल पहले ये दर्द ये पेन पाँव में और कमर में आया था दस साल पहले इनसे पहले उधर अफगानिस्तान काबुल में डॉक्टर के पास गया था तो उन्होंने मेरे सामने सब था तो ये फिर ठीक नहीं हुआ तो उनके बाद इधर आया इंडिया दिल्ली में तो कोई और डॉक्टर था उनके पास गया सो उसने कहा इनके ऑपरेशन होता है नी का कमर का सो हमने ये एक्सेप्ट नहीं किया इसलिए कि इनका एबिलिटी यू नो नहीं था टू ऑपरेशन के लिए एक टाइम इन द सेम टाइम सो हमने डॉक्टर महाजन की आदरस ली मेरे दोस्त ने मेरे को आदरस दिया डॉक्टर महाजन की उसने अफगानिस्तान से वो आदरस सेंड किया तो हमने डॉक्टर महाजन को कॉल किया जब इधर आया तो बस उसने कहा कि मैं जस्ट ये नी का ऑपरेशन करूँगा कमार का नहीं करूँगा इसलिए कि प्रॉब्लम है इनका एबिलिटी उतना ज़्यादा नहीं है जब हम दो ऑपरेशन करें सेम टाइम सो इट्स वेरी बिग प्रॉब्लम सो तो उन्होंने ऑपरेशन किया दो घंटे में ऑपरेशन वो हुआ ख़त्म हुआ तो अब ये इसका उन्हीं का प्रॉब्लम जो था वो बिल्कुल फिनिश हुआ है ख़त्म हुआ है नो प्रॉब्लम पेन भी कम हुआ है अभी ये अच्छी तरह चल सकती है पहले से बहुत ज़्यादा सो हेल्थी भी है एंड कमर का दर्द जो था वो भी सोल्व हुआ सो नाउ इट्स इट्स गुड नो प्रॉब्लम See, Bibi Said was a 55-year-old female. She came to me from Afghanistan. When this lady was brought to me, she had already visited some four-five doctors in Delhi, Afghanistan, and Pakistan as well. She had been advised. She was. Uh, she had been advised surgery of her spine and surgery of her knees because she had. a problem in her spine and problem in the knees lot of investigations had been done all the investigations were showing that there is a disc problem in the spine both the knees are also not doing well there was osteoarthritis advanced of both the knees but the problem when what is more important in such patients is that we need to isolate what exactly is the root cause of her problem investigations if i do for a normal patient like mris might even tell us some problems which are not bothering us because these are sensitive investigations a lady who has problem in her knees will also have problem in her spine and vice versa because of imbalance and other mechanical issues So once we got her I got her on the table and I examined her and what did I see she had no deficit there was no neurological problems down so even if she had an mri showing disc does not mean that the disc was causing her a problem though there was no deficit there was no problem so all the problems of gait and everything were happening because of knees the knees were imbalanced she had gross varus of around 25 to 30 degrees on both the knees she had a flexion deformity of both the knees if i'll take a height into account over a span of 2 years she had lost her height by nearly 2 inches so what whenever she was walking she had an unsteady gait that was causing a change in her center of gravity and leading to problems in the back we she has arthritis of the spine as well because but that is age related and but knees causing an mechanical imbalance was causing problem in the spine as well so i advised her not to do a spine surgery but to do a knee surgery in the form of a both knee replacements because 
I personally felt that once I do her knees and correct her mechanical axis, her spine will get better. So in her case, we took her in, we did her spine surgery, uh, I did her both knee surgeries, and after her knee replacement, this lady, as you will now see, it is only 10 days after surgery, she is walking very comfortably. Her gait has improved. Today she has come for a stitch removal after 10 days, but see the confidence with which she is moving. And for her spine, she is just using a simple lumbar belt and she feels much happy. She says she is not on much painkillers and still she feels her spine has improved. So that means whatever was happening, whatever we thought before surgery, that it is mechanical imbalance has proven right. So if now retrospective or prospective when I now see patients in my clinic, in my chamber, I tell them, okay, back hurts, knee hurts, let's try to find which is worse, which is the one which is affecting your quality of life. पहले से ये भी इस तरह वो डॉक्टर ने कहा माजन ने कहा ऑपरेशन करो सो ये नहीं मान ली थी ये ऑपरेशन नहीं करती थी इसने कहा पता नहीं है अगर मैं ऑपरेशन करूं ठीक हो जाऊंगा या नहीं तो ये प्रॉब्लम थी जब इसने ऑपरेशन किया अभी तो ठीक हो गई हां ये कहता है कि ऑपरेशन के बाद बस वो जो ऑपरेशन हुआ नी का तो दर्द पहले बहुत ज्यादा था अब दिन ब दिन नो वो कम होता जा रहा है जा रहा है नो सो वो अभी पेन नहीं है ये गुड फीलिंग करेगा एंड तीन दिन बाद आफ्टर थ्री डेज ऑपरेशन के बाद सो ये वॉकिंग कर लिया बस सो दूसरे पेशेंट्स के लिए मेरा मैसेज मैसेज ये है कि जब उनके नी में या कमर में प्रॉब्लम है जो डॉक्टर उनसे कहेगा कि इसका ऑपरेशन करो so some uh, some of them वो नहीं करते हैं इसलिए वो बोलता है कि ये पता नहीं कि हम ठीक हो जाते हैं या नहीं बट मेरे ख्याल में वो ऑपरेशन करें नहीं का या कमर का क्योंकि मैंने अपने मदर को ऑपरेशन किया है तो अभी बहुत हेल्दी है चल भी सकती है नो प्रॉब्लम सो अगर वो भी करें और वो भी डॉक्टर माजन के पास इट्स गुड सो हम डॉक्टर रमनीक महाजन से बहुत थैंक्स करेंगे क्योंकि उसने ये जो ऑपरेशन किया ये मेरे माथे को माथा ठीक हुआ है तो हम बहुत खुश हैं उनसे remembering a very good line life is mobility and mobility is life so keep doing something that will help you in the future